I'm here at the world famous Gun and More factory to show you how this turns into this. Hi Phil. Hi Will. So how does it all start? Okay, so we take the tree in its raw form. The first thing we do is chainsaw it up into rounds. And from that round, uh, we then slice it up into what we call clefts using axe and mallet. Want to have a go? I'd love a go. Quick tap on there for me. So how do you choose which line to go then? You're looking for the right in the wood. Yep. And then just follow those. Because when you're sawing them, you don't want to see them in the middle of a blade. That's so how many bats will we get out of this piece of wood? Eight bats. Oh, so two per quarter? Yeah, two per quarter. Nice. On, this, on this side. Yeah. There we are, done. One beautiful bat for you. Well done. After working up a sweat, I found out it takes over six months for the wood to dry out naturally, before being placed in the kiln to dry for a further five weeks. But at this stage, it's still not something I can see myself taking to the field with. I was about to meet a man that would change that thought. This is where Adrian does all his grading of the bats and hopefully picks you up some decent sticks. We're looking at each piece of wood and grading it into a specific part. No other different parts we do. Okay. Um, a piece of wood like this. We'll go into our top end bats, okay. a limited edition. So is that off the grain? Yeah, 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 yeah. Just, just very nice, straight grain, uh, evenly spaced. Yeah. Um, no hard marks or anything. Okay. Um, weight wise as well, it's pretty light. So I've here you picked me three nice bats that are yeah, going to I've tease got some Yeah, I've got three here probably. that are there marked for you. Um, so how did you select these? How did you know that they Again, weight, these nice and clean. If you look at the grain structure. Yeah. Um, with the pros as well, it's quite important, but um, they're, they're fairly light. Cause yeah. You've got volume wise, it's got to be quite big. Yeah, I find it really weird how, and amazing really how, like, I could, that would be an actual bat that I use this season in a, in a first team game for, for knots. With Adrian selecting me the best clash for the job, it's time to start shaping my bat, hopefully for success. This is the exciting part. How long does it take for one bat? About three and a half minutes. Seeing the shape of my back come together, I can't help but feel like a kid in a candy shop. This is exciting, isn't it? It's my back, that. Hopefully not on the edges, with a bit of luck. So, Kev, this has just come out of the CNC machine, my back. Uh, I'm happy with the weight. What do we do next? OK, I'll shape the handle for you, see how you like it, and cool. go from there. I'm a little bit in awe of the level of craftsmanship that goes into every stage of production. I'm beginning to really appreciate why they come with a tagline made by England's best. How many years? 43. 43 years. How you do that, sir? Uh, same. Just touch it like that. Like that? And then like quick or so? Quick, quick as you can. Oh my god. There is no chance. Oh, there you go. I think maybe I should stick to cricket. Every bat that passes through the factory follows the exact same process and they make it look so easy. So this is the handling? Yeah, this is called binding. Binding, sorry, yeah. that's what I meant. Yeah. Oh, I've just turned it. Does that matter? Yeah, you oh, you need to... Oh, yeah, that's what I meant. I meant to do that. Yeah, yeah. You do, do that the whole way lot? Oh, does it do it itself? He's not going to go to plan, you know. There's going to be like more string up here. Look at that. Oh, look at that. Go on, give it some. Look at the state of that. Oh, I got the other way. <laughs> I think it's safe to say they won't be offering me a job anytime soon. Yeah, they wanted an extra grip, so I went back. Yeah, that's what he wanted. <laughs> Finishing touch is complete, and it's game ready. Job done. There we go. One finish. Perfect. Thank you very much. No problem. Just make sure you get some runs with it. I'll try. 